what's going on everybody? Mr. Liberty Studios back and I am back with another episode of the Minecraft Survival Guide. So today we're going to take a look at quite a few things. Um, one of those being some iron tools, some mining, and uh, so you might be asking what, why we're doing mining instead of continuing off the farming. Well, I've taken a look at our handy dandy chest here and we're all out of cobblestone. So. I figured we're going to take a look at some other mining strategies rather than just heading into, you know, some random mine shafts and grabbing, or not mine shafts, but mine caves. Why am I saying mine? Caves. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to head into, instead of heading into random caves, we're going to go ahead and build a mining strategy. But first, we might find some materials that we want to take and stone axes or pickaxes may not just do the job so we're going to do the same thing we do to build a stone pickaxe but do the same thing for iron and use our iron ingots we've created or smelted a long while ago if you guys remember that in back episode one or two and we're going to go ahead and do this with an iron pickaxe so we're just going to put that down there and we don't even need the shears i don't know why we have those on us but uh, yeah, so one thing I did off camera is I kind of got some stuff ready f to build a small little road because I like building a small little town. I don't know, it's just what I do instead of a big castle or something. And uh, well, that is why the lack of cobblestone was brought to my attention. So as you see, I uh, started it, but um, we don't have any cobblestone. So I think we're going to start right here like build our little um what i i build like a little shaft thing it's uh three by three well it's kind of three by three it's three by three with one sticking out so um yeah so i'm gonna build the base for you so how we go down is we go down by three by three so we're gonna go down like this so let's say this is our mine shaft down our mining strategy this is our mining strategy so we go three by three down like this but we also use ladders and so we don't uh like you know make the three by three like miss even or something we also take out this and this is where the ladder will go in this block right here so the ladder goes down there and then we'll continue to mine like this so uh, i think you guys get the idea but um I, I don't want the ladder to go right there i think we're gonna have it go right here so in order to make ladders i will show you guys how to do that because it's part of our mining strategy we're just gonna take the entire stack of wooden planks there and leave those just for tools and turn this all into sticks now what we're gonna do is the two the left the far left and the far right column or yeah the vertical is a column vertical yeah so a column the far left and right columns are gonna be filled with sticks so we're gonna do that and then the dead center square will be filled with sticks so you should get something that looks like an H yeah so a capitalized H and we'll get some ladders so we're actually going to save these sticks because we don't know how far we're going to need to go down. Whoops. So then we've got that. And now when we come over here, we can put ladders and we can just go up and down. So you would think a ladder would do what a ladder is said to be done. But um, I'm going to take out this area right here so we can put cobble around it. Because I'm not sure how I want to design the top section of this mine shaft. So, on the way up, we should have enough cobble. But, uh, so, as you can just see, as I'm demonstrating, we're just going to build straight down. Or not build, but mine straight down, like so. We're just going to keep doing that. We're going to keep going in this 3x3, three three plus with a little extra step for the ladder. But on the way down, to keep it from being too dark, we're also going to place torches on the opposite side of the ladder. So, this is the ladder right here. And then, every, I don't know, every so, every... Every, I don't know, I'm going to say, if you want to play it safe every like five blocks or so, you're going to want to place a torch, and it's it's going to be easier to tell once it's darker outside, but, uh, so, you'll just place a torch on this opposite side of the wall, and place your ladder right here, and we'll just keep going, so let's see, that is four blocks down, wait, yeah, because that would be a block up there, so four, this would be in five blocks, this would be five blocks right here, so every five blocks or so, and we're just going to continue mining down, and uh, the really my whole point of doing this is not only does it get you some resources, you're gonna fall into a cave. It's um, you're gonna fall into at least two or three caves. You're gonna get about quite a. I don't. I don't want to give an estimate of how many st stacks of cobblestone you'll get because it's been a while since I've done this. And this is really nice 
because you know exactly where it is you don't have to you know how to get out because that's one of the main problems that happens with caves is you just don't know where to go you, you can't get out and uh, this is you just know where to go and then once we hit towards the bottom of this of the uh, world I will show you a different strategy on how to get even more blocks or even more materials so we've already ran across some, across some coal and uh, I'm gonna use some of the cobblestone we've got we've got because we already have a stack and we're not even close to all the way down to the uh, bottom of the earth here or the bottom of this square earth so we're gonna need so once we mine this up and uh, so as you can see it's gonna mine up where the ladder is supposed to go we'll just replace where we mine with uh, cobblestone so we'll make it nice it's gonna look nice once we're done and then uh, but yeah so just uh, when you're mining, a, qu a quick tip here is do not mine straight up or down for the following reasons. You could fall into a cave and die, or you can mine straight up and uh, there might be lava there that comes down, or a creeper uh, because there's a cave there. So there's multiple reasons not to mine straight up, and you just don't want to do that. So I recommend not to. So yep, we're just going to cover that and place these ladders down. I want to continue mining and uh, this will eat up your pickaxe so but we will have plenty of cobblestone to replace them so do not worry about that so we're going to continue mining here because we already got 26 uh, coal from that and uh, we're bound to find iron as well and uh, yeah so we're just going to keep mining here and let's see how many blocks one two oh, yeah one two three four five we're going every fifth block i think so one, two, three, four. No, we'll go every f sixth block. Okay. So we got uh, torches going, and uh, we're going to keep mining here. So, whoop, I almost just broke up my own rule of mining straight down. So, ouch. That is, uh, I guess that's not technically my rule. That's uh, that's just a common rule, not to mine straight down. It's, uh, yeah, it's kind of, it, it ends up being Minecraft common sense. If you got common sense, and then you got Minecraft common sense. Uh, Minecraft common sense says do not mine straight down or up so I'm just gonna keep mining here though and uh, yeah so I will probably fast forward through most of this just so you guys can uh, see that I am legitly doing this and uh, yeah so oh wait we just found some iron nice so we're gonna keep going here and keep mining all the way around and uh, yep we've already found some iron so this may not be the most efficient way to gather our um, materials such as iron and coal but it is a nice way to gather a ton of cobblestone at the same time so and then we're gonna cover that up make it look nice and you gotta remember to place your ladders and torches because you don't want to leave those behind and then realize oh I dug too far and didn't have enough ladders to get up or can't place a torch far enough up so that's two three four five six perfect so uh, yeah we're gonna continue down all right so uh, I've been making some progress and uh, I ran across across some gravel I don't know if I've uh, described what gravel does but gravel is a fallable it's a block that falls so it's like sand and uh, which if you mine the block under it it falls down one and you have the chance of getting flint from it so if, let me just dig it up real quick and uh, there we go Ooh, and some redstone perfect so good time to start recording again but uh, flint is uh, used to make arrows and uh, we'll get into arrows and things of that nature later but perfect we found some redstone so let me just mine this down because it will drive me nuts if I uh, don't and hang on one two three four five six so redstone is one of those uh, it's one of those materials that can't really be mined with with a stone pickaxe and like you just saw me do I mined it up and I didn't get anything and that's because it's not meant to be mined with a stone pickaxe so and there goes one redstone we have just lost and it's also one of those uh, materials where it drops multiple it doesn't drop one but it drops multiple of its sort so let's mine it up with our iron pickaxe it has to be iron or better and it drops a uh, redstone which is like a power wire you could say used to power things and uh, there's our redstone so let's continue mining see if we got more nope actually we've hit the bottom so we've hit the bottom of the world and uh, let's see just enough ladders 
and we created just barely enough ladders perfect so this is good look at uh, how far we've gone and we're at the bottom of the world and uh, let's take a look at the inventory we got a we didn't get much like I said it's not the best uh, way to earn a bunch of material of iron and coal but it is a good setup to earn a lot of cobblestone and so uh, it's one step into the next mining strategy I have for the Minecraft mining now this strategy is better for acquiring diamonds quickly and we're going to um, we're we're gonna acquire quite a few diamonds hopefully from the strategy and actually I'm gonna make a run to the surface cuz I can't tell if it's getting dark or not so we're gonna head up there plus we need to top off our mining shaft so nothing falls in after us that would be bad so we're gonna head up I think it is night and I did make a quick run up earlier during off camera and finished out this it's almost night and I finished that I don't know like I said I got this ready but I wasn't sure how we were gonna design it design the whole mineshaft so I'm go to bed real quick it's only sleep it tonight there is no napping in Minecraft. Okay, so we don't have very many stone stairs left. We're gonna make some of those real quick. I mean, not like we have a shortage or anything. We're also going to make more pickaxes. And we're going to start cooking off our iron. And that should be good. I don't think we need ladders, so we can drop those. Actually, that's a building block, technically. And, um, yeah, that should be good. So, how are we going to do this? How are we going to do this? I'm not sure how we want to make our mining shaft. First, I think we're going to continue the road. And just connect them first. So, I think that should be... That, that ought to do it. I wish it could like hmm. yeah we'll just uh, we'll just connect it like that so it goes up and here it is so how are we gonna do this hmm I don't know if we want a door I think we're gonna put a door hmm I'm trying to think no I think we're gonna leave it open I think we're gonna make f uh, f I have an idea. We're gonna need to chop down this tree. We're gonna need. I have a. It's gonna be similar to our house, sort of. It's gonna be like a farm in the house put together, except without the farm and without the living space. So we're gonna need to chop down like two or three trees. So how many do we have? Nine, ten. Yeah, we're gonna need to chop down like two more. So we're just chopping down those trees that we have replanted, because we're gonna keep the forest going. But I don't think I'm going to replant these ones because I don't like how they're so close to the house. So we're going to go back over here. And I have an idea. So where are the corners? That is... This would have to be a corner. Okay. And we're going to make it about three tall. We we'll need the others to be planks. We we'll need a crafting table out here, so might as well make one now. And we can move it, but we're just gonna place it right there for the time being. And we're gonna need some fence. And just place that like so. Yes, we, I kind of want this to be like an open area. We need three more fence, so that's, uh, that should just be, oh, wow, we're going to need more trees in a second. Yeah, we're going to need more wood for our plan, our planning of plans. So we'll just chop down this guy. This should be enough. 
Let's see. Yeah, that, I think that should be enough. So we're going to continue back. And we're almost going to design it like that, like our house. But it's going to go across. So I need to get up there somehow. Do we have, yeah, no, we're going to use dirt. Yep, okay, perfect. If we can, come on, ah, oh, dang it. Ugh. Okay, so I think I don't, yeah, perfect. This is going to work out great. I don't, I don't know, I haven't really made a structure like this. Well, I guess like open with fence at the bottom. I just thought it would be a good idea, so we'll try it out. And then we're going to need some stairs. Are you serious? We are going to need more wood. Let's see if we have any stairs left over. I, I bet we have fence left over that we should have used. Yeah, one fence. Well, let me add to that. And uh, two stairs. And I don't want to use... I, I don't want to touch that. Or that's going to be like our reserve wood just in case we need something really quickly. So we'll just go chop down some more. Oh, and I did notice this. How oh, that is kind of messed up, so we're going to fix that. Perfect. And time to go back over here and grab anything that dropped from the trees. Saplings. And this tree. Just saplings. Okay. We got one apple. Oh, this guy did not want to... I do not want a floating tree. That is not good. Whoops, come on. Alright, so now we don't have that floating tree anymore. Shouldn't have it anymore. Anyways. So then we're going to chop down this one. Don't know, we're going to need about 20, I would guess. 20 logs. We're at 11. This should be 15. Uh, I'm going to say one more tree. And that zombie is, just came out of nowhere who burned in the light. And chop down these trees. And we're going to replant some of them just so they grow back. Of course, we do not want our beautiful trees to die. Oh, more apples and saplings. Whoops. Don't want to plant them too close together. Okay. I don't know why I go this way around the house. I could have gone behind the house, which would have been faster. Oh, well. It's already been said and done. Should be enough. Oh yeah, that should easily be enough. 20? Actually, I don't know. Whoops. Oh my, why does it keep doing that? Gotta place it towards the lower end. There we go. Just enough. I love it when that happens. Okay, now we're going to make some glass for the top. And we already have some, so we'll see if that would be enough. Actually, the first thing we're going to do, we're going to place... Um, I don't like how I switched the wood ring right there, so we're going to take our the dirt ring. I don't know, it's just kind of awkward. So we're going to take that out. Whoops. Oh. I can't get over there. Come on. There we go. And now we're going to take this glass and cover this top so no one or anything falls in. But we are going to need more. So you know where to get that glass. From sand. Haha. <laughs> so there's plenty of sand over here I did not know about. Because we went to... Odd lengths. Oh, I'm gonna 
Something just fell in here. Let's check this out. Oh, it's all falling in. Ooh, iron. This must be like some kind of cave or something. Just gonna mine this up. Now, this is what we're mining right now is uh, cobblestone sand. It's like sandstone. It's just cobblestone sand, pretty much. I'm gonna take that iron for sure. But we came here for sand. So we're gonna continue getting the sand. That should be enough. 43? I would think so. So the place is coming together well. And yep, that is done. And we can put in the... Uh, to make this go faster, I think we're going to split this up. Oh, that already has coal in it. Perfect. Eat our apples. And... Um, we just need to kind of wait for this that. So as that cooks, I'm going to see what we can do with the roof. I think we should put glass around the roof as well so s sun goes down into it. Okay, cool. And then, of course, we'll just need two more. Let's see. Yeah, we should have enough. And this is going to be cool. Uh-oh. It's becoming night. Yeah, that looks nice. Once we get the uh, sand and everything in it. I think we'll leave the front, like, open like it is. But, uh, yeah, we're gonna go back into our house. And drop that off. We don't need sandstone, really. Let's see. It's 12 glass already. That should be enough. No, let's see. That top needs... 4, 8, no, 3, 6, 9, 12, I think on the top and then 2 left, so, 12, okay, no, I think that should be enough, math, such, so genius, so we'll cover that so we can stand on it, and we'll see what we get to, ah, yes, perfect, so, that, uh, that is a lot better, we could stand in here, and we're going to mine this up and move this to the bottom because we're going to need that at the bottom of our mine shaft. And our farm is growing well. So we're going to go back over here though. And let's see. Do we have enough? I do think we have enough of everything. Perfect. So we're going to make a trick here and uh, we'll see how this works. But... Um, I'm gonna go ahead. Um, there's a way to like where you jump off and land in water. Don't do what I just attempted by jumping off and recount catching yourself. All right. So what we're gonna do here is we're probably gonna go this way when we mine our uh, strip mining. So this new strategy, once you get to the bottom, is called strip mining. And we're gonna get rid of all this dirt because it's kind of annoying. And we'll just do that. And, um, let's see. We're going to need to get rid of all of this. All of this gravel. Strip mining is bad when there's gravel, so we're going to just... We're going to have to start prepping for strip mining by getting rid of all of this. Which is there, and there is a lot. Honestly, I don't think we need to get rid of it right here. Yeah, on this side, you know what? We don't need to get rid of it on this side. We just need to get rid of it between these walls. So like in here. So that's uh, one advantage you can use for gravel. Since it does fall, you can just go back and forth like this. Mine's up easier. Oh, And we don't have... Okay. And this is why we brought this with us. So we're going to just place that there. And actually we need sticks. And we can make two shovels. Alright, perfect. And get back to work. And I think this should be the last area like right here. Go. 
gold. Ooh, look at that. We found some gold. So gold is kind of useless unless you're building power rails. Just using for a railing system, which will probably be in part of the advanced guide. And it needs a gold. It needs a gold. Uh, not a gold. It needs a uh, iron pickaxe to mine up the gold. Iron or diamond. But uh, yeah, we just got we got our um, iron on us, so we just use that. And then we're going to just put some cobblestone. And uh, that should be good. Perfect. And we'll just fill this back up with cobble. And we're not going to fill up the rest. We're just kind of fill up the wall because we might just mine. We're going to mine through there anyways. We just want to make it look nice. So, yeah. So, we're going to dig down this hall. We're going to dig down this hall by like 10 blocks. So... Alright guys, so uh, I think we're going to end it here, and um, next episode will be a continuation of the mining and uh, the strip mining part now that we have the main setup ready. So, thanks for watching, hope you guys enjoy the series, and if you do, remember to leave a like because it is always appreciated. And uh, in the next episode I will have this uh, hallway cleared out and uh, ready to go for the next step in this uh, mining process and looks like we just grabbed some iron so I'm just gonna grab that real quick don't mind me you know just uh, got a ton of gravel that I don't I don't really use gravel anymore because the old gravel looked better than the new gravel but uh yep that should about do it and uh, yeah see you guys in the next episode <laughs>